Hello, my name is Colleen Hebel and I'm a teen specialist for the Central Rappahannock Regional Library. And today I'm going to give you two book talks. The first book is The Vanishing Deep by Astrid Schult. And the second book is Every Other Weekend by Abigail Johnson. The Vanishing Deep is a science fiction novel set in a post-apocalyptic world that is covered by water except for a few islands that is home to humanity. 24 hours. That is all the time Tempe has with her sister, Licia, to uncover why her sister lied about their parents' death before the palindromina procedure leads her sister permanently dead. During the 24 hours, Tempe and Alicia will go on a mad chase through their island home a vast ocean, and they'll be chased by a palindromina employee and pirates as they uncover the mysteries surrounding their parents' death. Along the way, Tempe will discover that the cost at a second chance at life may be too high for anyone to pay. And that was The Vanishing Deep by Astrid Schult. Next, we have Every Other Weekend by Abigail Johnson, which is a realistic fiction novel with a romantic thread. Adam's awesome life has unraveled. His oldest brother is dead. His dad has moved out and lives in a terrible apartment. His mother is crying all the time and his relationship with his last remaining brother is tenuous at best. While he does not like his dad right now, the best part of those weekends is when he spends time with Jolene. Jolene's life has already unraveled. Her divorced parents use her as a pawn in their games. And she spends her dad's weekends in his terrible apartment with his much younger girlfriend. The only way for her to escape her parents is for her to apply to a prestigious summer filmmakers program for high school students. In the in-between time, she spends those weekends with Adam. Adam and Jolene's friendship develops into a romance, but it may hit a snag when Jolene's life starts to unravel some more. And that is Every Other Weekend by Abigail Johnson. I hope you like one of these books because they're really great. So I hope you read them today. Thank you. Have a nice day.